massive subsidization of the New York State horse racing industry creates a wrong against the two most vulnerable members of our society. In propping up an archaic, dying gambling business, the state is cheating school children out of tens of millions of desperately needed education dollars each year. But this corporate welfare also allows for the continued abuse and killing of beautiful, majestic horses. Since 2009, when the state began releasing data, over 1,600 horses have perished at New York State tracks. That's an average of over well, well over 120 every single year. And this is not just a cheap track problem. Saratoga Racecourse, perhaps the preeminent track in the country, averages 15 kills per summer. And Belmont Park, the site of the third leg of the Triple Crown, has recorded over 100 deaths in just the past two years. What's more, two independent studies indicate that the majority of spent or simply no longer wanted racehorses land in equine hell at the end of their so-called careers, the slaughterhouse. Nationally, this translates to between 10 and 15,000 of these erstwhile athletes slaughtered annually. All of this, of course, says nothing of racing's many other wrongs. Forced separation, intensive confinement, social isolation, commodification, drugging, doping, whipping, etc. In short, we at Horse Racing Wrongs are asking that you please support this bill and know that by doing so, you will be lending your voices to the truly innocent and defenseless. Thank you. Thank you so much.